Hello Scorpio, this is Gypsy Spirit here and I'm here to give you your tarot reading for February 19th through the 25th and uh, please keep in mind this is a general reading uh, so you got to pick your story um, if some of it may resonate some of it may not and what resonates wonderful what doesn't that's okay too uh, but if you want your own personal reading you can go to my website and we'll talk about that later let's go ahead and get started I've already pulled your cards and uh, it's early in the morning so I'm like trying to wake up here maybe I need to go get me a cup of coffee or something but anyway we got the Queen of Wands um, by the way this is the Alice in Wonderland deck I love this deck it's very colorful and whimsy the Eight of Wands and the Ace of Cups so it looks like to me uh, Scorpio that emotions uh, you know the Queen of Wands and the Eight of Wands it's like uh, you're no longer feeling trapped in a situation that you've been in. The Queen of Wands, it's like you're, you've are you been like isolated or have felt isolated, uh, kind of on a desert land, but now you're becoming, stepping into your own power and, and in your own truths and, and getting the, the, the wisdom, the knowledge, whatever that you need so that you can move on. The queen, she's in charge of everything. And it, it, it tells me when I see this card, it's like you're finally taking a stand and taking a charge of your life. Whereas you felt trapped uh, in something, trapped in your mind or, or trapped in something, uh, trying to work through something, we're having a hard time. But you have the eight of wands here that is telling me that, you know, it's there's this there's energy that you've been carrying for a while is starting to lift and you're starting to see a way out you're starting to uh, be able to to see the the light at the end of the tunnel here a little bit but for some reason Scorpio yeah Scorpios you're so loyal you're, you're, you're such loyal creatures um, and, and yet even though you know it's like the universe is helping you giving you the opportunity <laughs> Can't do it that way giving you the opportunity of um, growing and and getting the insight that you need and standing in your own power you're still not letting go of some of those emotions you know and those emotions are like holding you down tying you down um, whereas the eight of wands here is telling you yes get ready move it's time it's time you know, uh, whatever it was that you've been needing to heal from, it's it's time to move on. Um, you've got the strength and the power that you need to move forward. But so let go of that energy. We're getting ready to move into spring. The season of spring is coming on us very quickly. So, you know, with spring, it always, to me, it represents new beginnings a rebirth and I feel like that with the Queen of Wands and the Eight of Wands coming the showing up in this reading it's like time for a rebirth with you Scorpio so but you're still hanging on to some of those old feelings and emotions and uh, it's it's hard to move forward when you have that so it's time to say goodbye to what has not been serving you those emotions and and memories that that have hurt you and and that you've like wrapped your head around and have been carrying it with you for so long it's time to say goodbye so i hope this helps scorpio um if you have uh, if you'd like to have your own personal reading you can go to the box below and my website is located there also if you'd like to have your own personal reading every month with me you can become a member at my Patreon page. Uh, that is also located in the box below. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And if you like, uh, would like to see more of my videos, hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much, and I will see you again next week, Scorpio. Bye-bye.